Good morning, Ephrata. Today is Thursday, October 20th. I'm Stephen Homan. And I'm Carl Jose. Please rise for a moment of silence and the pledge to the flag. This year's Powder Puff game is on Wednesday, November 9th, starting at 7 p.m. Both seniors and juniors will be having a meeting immediately after school today in the high school cafe. Check with Coach Fillmore or Coach Ulrich for practice times and schedules. If you are in the 10th, 11th, or 12th grade and need some help making career decisions, then consider taking the ASVAB. The ASVAB is designed to help you learn more about yourself and the world of work. Explore occupational skills in line with your interests and skills and develop a strategy to realize your career goals. This free assessment is offered at EHS on Wednesday, November 16th. Stop in the guidance office to sign up and learn more. Attention Mrs. Stauffer's animal science classes. Please report to the media center for class today. Please bring materials to work on your journal report. Again, animal science to the media center today. The veterinary assistant class at CTC is holding a Boktoberfest <laughs> in Willow Street <laughs> on Saturday, October 22nd from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. There will be a chicken barbecue, dog baths, microchipping, and more. Tomorrow, a representative from Penn State will be here at 8, a representative from Chatham University will be here at 9, and a representative from Wilkes University will be here at 1. Any students interested in meeting with a representative in the CRC, please sign up in Schoology. Last chance to tour the Lancaster Career and Technology Center. If you forgot to turn in your field trip permission forms, you can still do it ASAP. Attention seniors, on Friday, October 21st during Mountaineer Block, you will have the opportunity to hear a financial aid presentation from a financial aid expert. You will learn about filing your free application for federal student aid, your FAFSA, opportunities for grants, and more information about local scholarships. Do not miss out on this fantastic opportunity to learn about financing your post-secondary education. Then on Monday, October 24th, in cooperation with the Pennsylvania Higher Education Assistance Agency, Everett will be hosting a free financial aid night for students and families at 7 p.m. in the high school auditorium. Keep in mind, we don't have school to stay, but we do have the program at night. If you have any questions, please stop in the guidance office. This is a reminder to all ninth grade students. Freshmen, listen up. Individual freshman transition meetings begin this morning. During this meeting, you and your counselor will have an opportunity to discuss the successes and challenges related to your transition to the Everett High School grades, activities, and career ideas. This conversation will help you build a supportive relationship with your counselor as you reach for your future goals at EHS and beyond. Meetings are 10 minutes each and you will receive a pass on the morning of your meeting. Don't forget to touch base with your teacher on the day of your meeting in order to minimize class disruptions. Now over to lunch. Sloppy, today we have a sloppy joe with a whole grain roll, shrimp poppers, dip with yogurt or string cheese, and a whole grain roll and margarine. Flatbread pizza, grilled chicken Caesar wrap, crispy chicken salad, fruit and yogurt parfait with mutton, muffin, tossed salad, french fries, fresh broccoli or cucumbers and dip, chilled pears, fresh fruit or a slushy. Now a majority with sports. Century. Doing something mean to it Do it better than anybody you ever seen Do it screams from the haters Got a nice ring to it In sports results from yesterday The volleyball team 
thrashed the Barons of Mannheim 3-0 for their final game of the season. Good job, ladies. And there are no sports for today, but there is a very important announcement about dodgeball. Dodgeball fans, there is still time to sign up to play in the 13th annual dodgeball tournament on Friday and Saturday, November 11th and 12th at this Ephrata Senior High School. And also, we're just getting word in, it's Chris Hirschberger's birthday. Yeah! Proceeds from this event will help fight juvenile diabetes. You can find links to information and a registration form at effortamounts.com or see Mr. Geyer in homeroom 129 for registration information. Deadline for entry is next Wednesday, which is October 26th, which gives you this weekend to collect your donations. Each team is responsible for raising at least $126 with a three-game guarantee. Prizes will be awarded to the teams raising the most money. So get your team donations in for this year's senior circuit bracket. And remember, grab life by the ball. Now back to Steve and Carl at the main desk. It's time to buy your 2017 edition of the Cloister at Yearbook. The price will be at its lowest of the year until October 21st. That's in one day. So don't wait and order yours today at jostensyearbooks.com. You can also find an order form on the yearbook page on the high school website. Attention seniors, senior superlatives and senior votes are due on Friday, October 21st. That's this Friday. Please return your forms to Mr. Bischoff, Mrs. Jenshock, or Mr. Bieland, or the main office. Chess Club will be meeting in room 107, Tuesdays and Thursdays, starting this week. All abilities are welcome. See you there. Attention sophomores interested in leadership. Hobie essays are due this Friday, October 21st. As a reminder, two sophomores will be chosen to represent EHS at the local Hobie Leadership Seminar to be held at Shippensburg University in May. Hobie's purpose is to bring together high school sophomores to discuss present and future issues. Attending Hobie is a great opportunity to enhance your high school resume. If you are interested in representing EHS, submit a one-page essay on leadership to the guidance office by October 21st. See the Schoology class of 2019 group or Mrs. Sheekley for more information. And it seems we have a late announcement. Hans Kamruba! Thank you, Hans. Winter sports sign-ups will begin on Tuesday, October 25th in the activities office. Students have opportunities to participate in girls and boys basketball, girls and boys swimming, wrestling, co-ed rifle, and bowling. You must sign up by November 4th. And now that is the end of our show. Thank you, Ephrata, and have a wonderful, wonderful day. Ocean Man.